good morning, Internet. Uh, or at least uh, it's morning here. <laughs> I'm in North Carolina, and I'm eating yogurt for breakfast. Um, welcome to episode two of my tour vlog. The 2010. corn on the ground everywhere. <laughs> so I'm here in Carboro, North Carolina, preparing for my first tour kickoff show. But let's talk about last weekend. So last weekend I drove up to Annapolis, Maryland for a Chesapeake quarterly meeting and had a great crowd out there. <laughs> and the night before I played for a Chesapeake quarterly meeting, I got to meet with and play for the, uh, the Baltimore yearly meeting GIF program. <laughs> ton of fun. I haven't slept on the floor of Annapolis Meeting House since I was 16. Anyway, this week I'm in Carboro. I'm going to get my bike all set up for my tour. I'm going to put a, a flag on it, get everything ready, get a little bit of training in, and then play my big kickoff show and then head back up to Richmond and get, get ready for the next one. So last week I asked a question of the day, and at the end of this episode I'm going to post some of my favorite responses to that question of the day. This week's question of the day, since I'm about to pack all my stuff onto a bike and leave for Boston, and I'm trying to figure out what stuff I need to take and what I need to leave behind. If you were going to be on a bike for one month, what would you be sure to not leave behind? Do you a little advice here. <laughs> and before I go, I just want to introduce you to my bike. This is the Extra Cycle Radish. It's a long tail cargo bike. And you can see from the back of it that I can fit just a ton of stuff in there. So I'll be able to put my guitar and my amp and my tint and my CDs and everything on, on the back of this guy. So that's it for this episode, Internet. Uh, be sure to check out my schedule on johnwatts.com slash shows. And be sure to leave your response to the question of the day in the comment section below. Peace. Exhale, love. Inhale. Exhale, love. Inhale.